The Nekatal Dam, which is three times bigger than the Haldab Dam, has a catchment capacity of 4,5 million hectares. The dam was also designed to feed the irrigation project to be situated about 26 kilometers away. The Nekatal Dam and the irrigation scheme were initially to be developed into two phases. These are the feasibility study, design and the actual construction of the dam, as well as a 5,000 hectares irrigation project. The government was only able to complete the feasibility study for the construction of the irrigation project due to the economic situation in the country and the high cost involved in the construction phase. Among the remaining work includes the identification of the land, clearing of the land, fencing it off, and developing irrigation infrastructure for small and medium-scale component of the farm. Regrettably, the minister says all these are no longer attainable under the current economic conditions. In addition, Schledwein says it was also discovered that the soil suitable for the irrigation project is not enough. The positioning of the irrigation project was therefore mainly dependent on the locations where suitable soil were found. The ministry then identified the following three distinct areas with suitable soils for irrigation and development of irrigation around Nekatal. There were three farms, farm Slangkopf, 1,900 hectares, the farm Dachbriak, 1,700 hectares, and the farm Skarpplas of 370 hectares. This implies that currently, in total, 3,907 hectares has so far been identified to be suitable for the irrigation development at Nekatau. An additional 1,030 hectares of suitable irrigation land is still needed to be confirmed because the ultimate goal and capacity is around 5,000 hectares. Government remains on a quest to identify the additional land in the surrounding area of Nekatal Dam to reach a target of 5,000 hectares to fully utilize water from the dam. For now, the water reticulation system to the Green Scheme irrigation project is currently not in place. However, water from the main dam to a balancing reservoir is already in place. Offtake from the balancing dam to the irrigation plots will only be developed during the second phase of the project, which is the construction phase of the irrigation scheme. The project came with benefits to the people in the Claras region in terms of job opportunities. During the peak of the construction period of the dam in 2018, it employed 1,486 people, of which 51% came from the Claras region. The government has invested $5 billion in the Nakatal Dam, making it the biggest ever project in the Claros region. The construction of the dam started in 2013. Timo Andreas, NBC News, Parliament.